But we will find out who is simply the best. Indeed, Bob, this is going to be a fantastic final, and there are a number of PNG runners here are going to try and finish this off and maybe finish in a very impressive one, two, three. But they could possibly do that. They could there, but uh, there's a young man in lane number four. We'll get to him in just a moment. Maybe you can run through the runners for us. Yes, uh, Jonathani Koroi from Fiji lane one. Obadiah Timbasi from Vanuatu in lane two. In lane three is Stephen Rahuasi from Solomon Islands. In lane four is Finn O'Sullivan from New Zealand. Lane five from Papua New Guinea, Emmanuel Wanga. Lane six from Papua New Guinea, Daniel Baal. Lane seven from Papua New Guinea, Benjamin Aliel. And in lane eight, Rizon Leo Rara. So there in lane number one is Koroi from Fiji. Comes in with a 50.67 qualifier on the inside lane. Tabati here from Vanuatu with a 50.44 qualifier. And on the outside, in lane number three, the local hope, and listen to the roar when he's introduced to the crowd, the 21-year-old from Solomon Islands. This is Stephen Raasi. He's been running exceptionally well as well. Let me tell you, we're 50.22 coming in here tonight, running big PB territory. Here's a man that could upset the sweep of the PNG aspirants. This is Finn O'Sullivan out of New Zealand. And he could prevent the clean sweep. Qualified in a 49-3-1. This man, a sub-50 as well, Emmanuel Wanga from Papua New Guinea. Baal here. He's qualified in a pretty handy 48.44. And Aliel on the outside, qualifying in a 48.23. Two. Rara out in lane number eight. So the PNGs, two of them, Baal and Aliel running in lane six and seven, sub 49s, and O'Sullivan and Wanga just inside them in lanes four and five, sub 50s. Bob, the scene is set for a possible PNG clean sweep here. They would like it because they've had uh, a fairly disappointing meet so far, and this could raise the raise the good feelings around Papua New Guinea if it happens if men's 400 final keep an eye on lane 6 and 7 the PNG runners here going to try and do something special and they've got off to a flyer as well Aliel down the back straight already pulling in Rara not also noticing that uh, the New Zealand runner beginning to make a little bit of a move as well, O'Sullivan. Just have a look at Baal there as well in lane number six. Going very hard at the moment is Aliel out in seven. On his inside, that is Baal. Wanga there as well, beginning to make a bit of a move. So it's the boys in lane uh, five, six, and seven at the moment. The PNGs in lane seven, leading at the moment is Benjamin Aliel. On his inside is Daniel Baal, beginning to make a little bit of a move. Who's going to take this? It's down to the two PNG flyers at the moment. Aliel, it's Ben Paul, it's Aliel. Baal, not sure. Got a feeling it's Aliel, just diving finish. I don't think it was a clean sweep. I think lane one, Kuroi from Fiji might have just got the bronze. But it was a very exciting race. Fantastic. 400 meters final and the boys having a look at the big screen they want confirmation as well and uh, Daniel Bell uh, his main main event is the 400 hurdles well Bell did extremely well let's have a look at this and you can see out in lane number seven I tell you what Aliel was letting nothing in the tank he absolutely hammered very hard pulled in Rara within the first 100 meters and then down the back straight they let it rip the three PNG boys absolutely on fire down there um, the PNG three just beginning to dominate. O'Sullivan trying to hold on, but beginning to tie up a little bit. And here's uh, on the inside, Bal just beginning to make a little bit of a move as well. And on the inside of him as well, Wanga as well beginning to make a move. And at this stage, Papua New Guinea had one, two, three in their keeping. Who was going to take it? And uh, as they finish off here, Bao beginning to make a little bit of a move on the inside. Aliel's there as well. And a big diving finish right on the line. Does not deny Aliel out in lane seven. He gets it. And I got a feeling that uh, 
Wanga here might have just done enough to get home in third. Bow a big lunge. Aliel doing the job. Ah, yes, it was. Um, oh, it, it was Emmanuel Wanga. It was a clean sweep for Papua New Guinea. So I didn't PNG, think it. And they've just seen the results as well. So Papua New Guinea celebrating. Aliel in a 47. They're there with the coaches there. Very happy. 47-17 for Aliel. 47-21 for Bao.